Sorry, I just dropped my phone. Look, there's something serious about to roll through here, it looks like. Good old little storm coming through. Hopefully it won't lay down much stuff in my uh, garden. But yeah, I was just saying, well, whenever I, I dropped my phone going through the door, I was like, oh, so I got a little kicker out of that. But, you know, I was just saying how um, uh, I just rejoice. I really did just love hearing a testimony about someone coming to the Lord because that's what it's all about. You know what I mean? He, like I said, the souls are valuable to Christ. You know what I mean? It's a, it's a, they really are, and it ought to be a valuable thing to us if we took seriously what we read in the Bible and that eternity is a serious thing. Then you know what I mean? We would look at souls and people that are in darkness and they're they're blind because the God of this world has blinded their eyes, and we would look on them and would like, you know what I mean? Some kind of like just like they were running into a burning building on fire like literally like they're running into that because that's what a lot of these people are doing they're running in to a burning hell you know what i mean of eternity so whenever someone gets saved it's like praise god like how you would be if a firefighter went in some house and you saw him bring a baby out and the house was on fire and you whoo hell yeah you did great you did great you know what i mean what's well, man when someone gets saved that's how we ought to be lord give me a heart for the lost so praise God, I'm just saying, just, uh, you know, um, I don't know, I just wanted to say, let it, it, it is about souls. I do seek souls. I do seek souls for God, for His glory. You know what I mean? It says in the Bible, the wise win souls, you know what I mean? And it, in Christ is my wisdom and sanctification and redemption. And in Him, you know what I mean? Like I've been saying, uh, all the, tre or He had stored all the treasures of wisdom and knowledge. And um, so, yeah, I mean, I I seek, I don't seek yours, but I do seek you. I do seek souls for the kingdom of God. That's why I'm willing to get on here and share my heart because I know the terror of the Lord. So, yes, I seek to persuade men that Jesus is the way, He's the truth, and He's the life. So, you know, faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word, like you hear me say a lot. And um, so I, I'm trying to proclaim His word you know what I mean? Praying that faith will come to someone's ears. This grace message will come to someone's ears that get down to their heart and it brings more glory to God. More people that are saved, it brings more glory to God because we're snatching them out of the fire, out of the enemy's hand. They're being brought out of darkness into the marvelous light. See, because Jesus, He said, the light come into the world, this is judgment. That light come into the world, but men love darkness rather than light, so their deeds were evil. See, but we've been saved. We've been called out of darkness into the marvelous light because Jesus is the light of the world. It's all about Him. Look, when you come to Jesus, the veil's removed from your eyes. When you read the law, everything, you see Jesus now. You know, He said when the Holy Spirit comes, He's going to take what is mine and He's going to show it unto you. He's going to convict the world of sin, of righteousness, and judgment to come. So, you know, if, if, if you're not feeling any conviction for your sin, it's like, what is going on? Even we as Christians, we need to walk and examine ourselves to see whether we're in the faith. Examine, he said, examine yourself. I'm not saying introspect, oh, am I saved? I'm saying examine yourself. Am I walking with the Lord? It, what would Jesus do? You know what I mean? Does what I'm doing, the choices I'm making, does this line up with the Word of God? So, yeah, I mean, um, just be careful. Even even every, every person that you, you, you want to give your money to or whatever, things like that, um, just... You know, I'm just saying, just be careful in the people that sees the people doing that and saying, see, I knew that's what they're doing it for. Not everybody's out uh, to seek what you have in your dollars and things like that. They really want to share the Lord Jesus Christ with you. I know some hearts that's like that. They want people. Look, Paul said it like this. He said, I'm jealous over you with a godly jealousy. You know what I mean? He, that's it. He said, I'm jealous over you with a godly jealousy because we know that you're created in the image of God. You're created to have fellowship with Him, not to be a slave to the flesh and to the enemy and to the world and to the devil. See, whatever whatever overcomes a man, he's a slave to that. So I want to be overcome by Christ. Like Paul said, I'm a bond servant of Christ. You know what I mean? I don't want to be a bond servant of the addictions in this world and, you know what I mean, the enemy and my own lust and covetous desires, a slave to even a job, to some man. You know what I mean? I want to grow in Christ, grow in the grace and the knowledge of the Lord Jesus Christ, and I'm seeking to bring more people to His kingdom. 
You know what I mean? To God's kingdom, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it's getting wet out here, on earth as it is in heaven. So praise God. I pray that uh, someone will hear this message today. Turn to the Lord that you'll be saved, that you'll be the next one to testify. Hey, I just got saved. Praise God. You know, it says all of heaven rejoices over one sinner that, that uh, repents than over 99 righteous persons that need no repentance. All of heaven will rejoice over you if you'll give your heart to God today. So if you'll cry out to Jesus, if you'll confess the Lord Jesus with your mouth and believe in your heart that God raised Him from the dead, you shall be saved. With the mouth you confess unto salvation, with the heart you believe unto righteousness. God bless you. Have a wonderful day.